Are you tired of being bullied? Are you tired of being a bitch? Are you tired of people destroying you at the park? Look no further, you came to the right spot. It's the Don Hamill 5, and now I'm back with some, with some fucking 2K. Obviously, it's all I ever do in my fucking life is play this damn piece of shit game. And I don't know why I put damn in front of my whole sentence, but I did. It sounded awkward, but let's get right into it. The best center build. Okay, make a 7-3 outside center, and this is what you want to do first. And I know what you guys are saying. How is this the best center build? He's only an 88 overall. What the fuck? This is not. This is clickbait. This isn't the right... Put your common sense into it. This is ground zero. This is where you want to start. This is your base of your build. You want to have this up, get to an 88, and obviously play your career. I barely made this center yesterday. And how do I know this is the best center build? Because I've used my inside center before, like since October. And um, yeah, this is pretty much the best center build now. 7-3 outside center. Put this up. Obviously your defense. And I'm debating on playmaking or uh, inside score. So I'm going to put playmaking up just so I won't lose the ball as often. And let's get right into these animations. I'm using Aldridge on quick. Um, to me, it's still the best jump shot in the game. And if you're wondering what other jump shots you should use, I have a video of the top five jump shots in 2K. So go check that out if you haven't already. As you hear this, that's me rubbing my hands like I'm a fucking, like I'm Birdman. <laughs> and pay attention to these dunks. I'm not going to fucking explain which one is which because I can barely see it because the screen is so small and I'm far away holding the mic. So... <laughs> pay attention to the dunks I'm using uh, if you want to have these dunks because they hardly ever 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 get blocked I don't have any back scratchers or anything like that just side tomahawks and you know not, no no cockbacks nothing okay just side tomahawks and you know um, just cradle dunks here and there uh, you'll see you'll see them put equip what I have equipped on um, and yeah you'll see for yourself you, you will hardly ever get blocked and sorry for stuttering so much you guys I do have a stuttering problem I stutter a lot <laughs> I stutter a lot, so bear with me if you guys think I stutter so much. <laughs> I stutter a lot. Okay, I didn't take speech class, man. I couldn't afford this shit. We were fucking broke out here. <laughs> uh, dribble pull-up, that doesn't really matter. Uh, that's personal preference for you guys to decide what you want to use. Um, spin jumper doesn't really matter. I never really do it. It's not 2K15, so it's not overpowered like it used to be. Hop jumper, I, ha I don't have it on Curry anymore. I have it on Normal 3. Normal 3, I, in my opinion, is the best um, hop jumper hop step for the centers because you create so much space and you're so big and it, and you know, it just creates space, man. You'll get open a lot of the time using this move, just going back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. So let's get into the next one. Triple posture, I have it on low because I'm so tall. And if you hear the sound in the background, I live close to a fire station. So, <laughs> so I apologize. So yeah, keep keep the posture low so you don't get the stolen. And I have it on crossover 11. Crossover 11 for centers is so cheesy. It's like a, it's it's like the most overused term, uh, speed boost. But it does give you like a push to go forward really really fast. So I try to keep it on 11 if at all possible. If you want to change it up, then that's on you. But in my personal uh, preference, I have it on 11. So yeah, uh, crossover 11. Put that shit on. You'll see it's overpowered. Next is the, um, what's fucking? I can barely see my fucking screen. God damn. Is it behind the back? Behind the back, I have it on 14. Like I said, in my crossover 11, it does give you like a little push forward, like a small little speed boost. So it's like a little, it's like a little cheesy, you know, a little bit cheesier than your normal behind the back. Iso spin, I have it on uh, fucking five. I love spin five. I like the one he stands still, and that one right there, that animation. I love the animation. Uh, try to keep it on spin five. Um, Hezzy, you put it on Hezzy three. I mean, it's been Hezzy three since what 2K14, I think. So yeah. Keep it on Hezzy 3. I don't need to explain that much about that. Uh, size up doesn't really matter. I mean, I use 31, but I never really use it anymore ever since patch 6 because it's not overpowered anymore like it used to be. You know how 2K fucks up, you know. They, won't, they take all the good shit. Uh, inside out, I do not have Crawford. I have Steph Curry because I like the little, right there he goes behind the back, back pedal, back pedal. It gives you a, a ton of space. If you're stuck behind the screen, use that and you'll get wide open majority of the time. Um, next is... Um, that dab, I can't fucking see. All right, is a guard one, like a little crossover thing. Uh, like another another thing to create more space, as you can tell right there. Look at, that. yeah. So put that one on. Uh, escape. I still have it on Kobe. I don't know what people use nowadays. I'm not really into like seeing what people use. This one, I still use Kobe. I mean, it's it's still my favorite. You still create a ton of space going back, and that's pretty much all the shit you need to know. Now, I just hit Legend three, you guys. I don't know if you guys noticed. 
or if I didn't tell you guys, and I can buy any of these mascots. I bought my first one, I bought Hugo, because I like the color, I like the shoes. In the comment section below, let me know what fucking, what mascot I should buy. It's fucking expensive, so you guys better be fucking good at this. <laughs> It's a hundred fucking K, goddamn. Let me know in the comment section below. And that's the end of the player build. I have some gameplays coming up shortly. Like right now, like in 20 seconds from now. So if you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Subscribe if you are new. I can't stress that enough. I love you guys so much for subscribing. And uh, yeah, I'll be back later. Enjoy the gameplay. Peace.